Brought over to Japan from Korea 2,300 years ago, rice has been farmed by the Japanese ever since. The cultivation of rice has shaped the politics, geography, economy and culture of the country. It's early May at the local rice paddy and the planting process has just started. The rice production shaped the look and feel of the country. Rice accounts for one quarter of the daily calorific intake per person in Japan. In the Shinto religion, sake and rice cakes are the most sacred of offerings. The emperor of Japan himself is a rice farmer and has rice paddies on the grounds of the imperial palace. It is more than just food. Water is essential for rice. This rice paddy has been flooded in preparation for planting. One reason it is so important is because it is not imported unlike much of Japan's meat, fish and fruit. Japan is self-sufficient in rice and hence it is a symbol of independence. The language holds a few clues. The early indigenous name for Japan was Mizuho no Kuni, the land of the water, stalk, plant or rice. These are the rice seedlings ready to be planted. The politics of rice. After all that water and growing, this is the end product, a bowl of rice. A byproduct of rice production, of course, is Japan's national drink, sake. Come by. Brought over to Japan from Korea 2,300 years ago. <laughs>